Hey, Gary Baker here with PublisherReport.com. Today's video, I want to show you an online crossword puzzle maker. And I also want to do a little research here on Amazon to show you how to use this tool to find some space or to niche down inside of the crossword puzzle book genre or niche on Amazon. Because this tool doesn't make your traditional New York Times crossword puzzle, but I do think it's a very valuable tool and I want to show you exactly what I mean in this video. So here we are on Amazon and we're just going to go in here and we're going to look at crosswords. Crossword puzzle books right here and you're going to see all these different crossword puzzle books and if you were to simply click on crossword puzzle books what you're going to get is their traditional crossword puzzle right here that you see in the Sunday paper. Again the traditional New York Times or USA Today crossword with your traditional square and your black boxes that you see right here allowing separation for the words when you're looking for words across and down. So the idea here is is when you just search for crosswords puzzles or crossword puzzle books on Amazon you're looking at over 10,000 results for crossword puzzle books. So what if we were to look for crossword puzzle books for kids? You can see that takes the results right there down to 2,000 results. Then if you were to scroll down, you see one of the best sellers. Now this is sponsored, but if you keep scrolling down, you'll see it still is a best seller. And you're going to see that it has a BSR of 5,600, 5,669 to be exact as of the time of this video. Now if you were to click on this and look inside, and we're going to do that real quick because I want to show you the format here. And then I'm going to show you the tool and how this tool could be used specifically to create or recreate what they're doing here where you could take and you could emulate the success this book is having and you could create your own book around this crossword puzzles for kid niche or genre. So again we'll go ahead and we'll click on look inside. You can see here they have this nice cover which is targeted for the kids and of course for targeted for the parents or the grandparents or the person that's buying it for the kid. But I want you to take a look at this design. So this design is very simplistic and you can see how these boxes are bigger here and then they have the down and the across and then they have simple instructions put words to the pictures to solve the puzzles. So it's not the traditional st style or sense of having clues because the kids here are younger so really what they're looking for here is they're looking for clues that are the actual image themselves and created in this big box. So I think you can use the tool that I'm about to show you right now to make this type of book and really have a lot of success in the crossword puzzle niche making this type of book. So now let's jump over and let me show you what I'm talking about in the online crossword puzzle software that I think is really going to allow you to create a book just like this. So this puzzle software you see here on the screen is called Word Puzzles Generator and the one that we're focused on here is the crossword puzzles. So we'll go ahead and click access now. And you can see here you have the ability to just simply create or click create a crossword and then you could simply enter what you want to create here and we'll just go with kid crosswords and we'll go ahead and create. Now here you go ahead and you view that and then here's where you upload a text file. They do have a sample crossword input file here and I'm going to show you the file that I created and we're just going to upload that file right here by selecting upload and you're going to see right here what I have is an animal sounds crossword text file. And you can see that it just instantly created that puzzle for us. And you can see this style here, again, is not your traditional Sunday newspaper, US Today, New York Times crossword. But this software could be used very easily to create what we just looked at inside of that kids, kids puzzle or kids crossword puzzle book. Again, when you look inside that fun crossword puzzle for kids, you see this grid right here that is bigger than your traditional book. And you can see they just added pictures. So inside this puzzle generator software, and of course there's a link in the description, you can click on that link and you can actually see the sales page and purchase this. But I want to show you the options here because you see this is a little too small here. So what we can do is we can go inside of the settings and we can simply click on the settings. And here they have the ability to change the puzzle font size. Scroll down and you're going to see at about 30 how much bigger this gets. Okay, so you can see that that's a lot bigger now. And of course it has your traditional across and down clues. Pigs do this, donkeys make this sound, sound the cat makes. And of course you scroll down, you're gonna see that the answers are filled in too. So you could even put the answer key in your book. And you can see cluck, moo, oink. But what I wanna focus on is the ability to create or recreate or to emulate what we saw in that book that's so successful. 
See these clues right here? You can also go to settings and you can actually get rid of these clues. And now what you have is you have this grid right here, again, that you could add to your book. Again, you can go in here and you could also change the style if you would like to circles. So to give it again, getting a little further away from the traditional sense of a crossword puzzle. But again, it might be more fun for kids, something to play with. So at this point now what you would do is you would come in here and if this was too many clues, you could go ahead and click edit and you can see the text file right here. Now I mentioned that I was gonna show you the text file. So let me go ahead and show you that. This is the text file right here. It's simply just the list of clues or the list of words that are going to answer. So the answer and the clues and it's just a list of words with the clues separated by a semicolon that you upload into the software. Then once you're in the software, again, you can edit it as you see fit. So here for the title, we could just simply say animal sounds, and then we can save that, and you can see that it reset it, and all you need to do at that point is go back in here, and again, that may be too many clues, so you go in here and you could say, okay, let me take out this clue right here, or these two clues, and go ahead and save the changes. But you can see what happened here is you took out too many words, so the puzzle maker can't actually make the puzzle. So then we'd go ahead and we would wanna put those back in there. Go ahead and save your changes. And again, what we're focused on here is this ability to change the puzzle font size. And we'd go ahead and we'd go back to 30 on that. And we'd go ahead and not show the clues. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna download that. And we're gonna download that as a PNG. And then that's gonna download a zip file. We're simply just gonna open that zip file. Then it's gonna give us a folder. We're gonna open that folder. And here you're gonna see the PNG file. And then you're just simply gonna take this PNG file and you're going to upload it into something like Canva. And I'm gonna show you that real quick. So here you are inside of Canva. Of course, you can get a free account. Go ahead and click create a design. We'll go ahead and go with custom dimensions. An 8.5 by 11 is a good size book for kids. Then when you create that book, you'll go ahead and just go to uploads. You'd go ahead, upload to media, go to your device, open it up in a folder. Of course, that was kids crossword. We'll go ahead and open that up here. Then you would just select that puzzle. Now you can see what you're doing is you're just creating a book right here for animal sounds. And you can just center that right here in the book. Now, of course, you could go right here inside of Canva and you could look for, for example, you could find images like here. You could find an image for a pig. Of course, make sure you understand the license for this if you're gonna resell this. And you could simply start adding your elements right here and creating something that you saw just like in the other book that we found when we did our Amazon research, which was this right here. Of course, this is in black and white. So you could take that and you could make a color book and make it even better. Of course, you would need to make sure that the amount you could charge for the book and a number of pages and the royalties and all that, you do those calculations to make sure you're actually going to be able to come up with a good price point where you can actually sell it and still make money. But the idea here is you see that you're using this software to create something unique like this 101 fun crossword puzzle books for kids. Again, with a BSR of under 6,000 that you see right here, 5,699 in books. And if we go back and look for crossword puzzle books for kids, you're gonna see that there's only about 2,000 results for crossword puzzle, puzzle books for kids. And again, what you're doing is you're using the software that I linked to in the description that I just showed you to create these unique books to find this niche and this small but very lucrative niche inside or genre of crossword puzzles, crossword puzzles for kids, and using a picture book, sort of making a crossover type book or an activity book. I know for sure that I'm going to explore this and create my own book. That's why I wanted to make this video to recommend it to you and also show you the online crossword puzzle tool that I recently found. Of course, that is a paid tool, but if you're going to be in this business, you do need to invest in tools and invest in yourself and your business. So go ahead, link in the description, check that out. And if this video was helpful, give me a thumbs up. Type right it right here, click that, subscribe to the channel for more awesome videos just like the ones you see right here. Click those, keep watching, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.